Hello everybody, welcome back to the Nibiru channel. It is October 5th, 2016, and once again, rise and shine, and there is all kinds of activity going on all over this planet that we live on. We have a major hurricane over on the east coast in the Atlantic. We have a very active volcano that is being watched right now in the Canary Islands, and we have more increased earthquake activity out on the West Coast and also in the Ring of Fire. But I want to make a few quick announcements, so just bear with me. We added a new logo and background wallpaper to our Nibiru Planet X 2016 YouTube channel, so I didn't want anybody to panic and think we changed the whole entire channel. And our secondary channel was renamed Nibiru News, and we are going to use this secondary channel for actual Nibiru Planet X news and periodicals. There will be a report on this channel once a day, so make sure you go over to this channel and subscribe because I am going to leave a link in the description box under this video and there will be a worth of information provided there daily. We just didn't want to mix it up with all of our photograph and video evidence that we get on our Nibiru channel. channel. Now that we have that out of the way, I received more photographs this morning by email, once again, of this metallic planetary object in the sky. Now, these photographs that you're looking at, you've probably seen here before on our channel. And these were on the All Sky Cam Network, oh, maybe about two weeks ago. And we publicized them in one of our videos. And still, we have not been able to figure out exactly what this is. We have sent the photograph off to a professional. He looked at it, and his conclusion was that it seemed to be a very large metallic object in the sky. The photograph that you're looking at right now, he referred to it as the silver baked potato because it had such a odd shape to it. We did question him heavily on these photographs, and he pointed out to us if this was some type of reflection back into the lens, then it would not show cloud cover overlapping the actual object. Now, getting into another photograph that you guys have probably seen before is this large planetary body with this huge triangular indentation, uh, cutout, whatever you want to call it. Now we're receiving more photographs from other individuals showing a similar object. Now, we just picked up some more photographs just like this once again on the All Sky Cam Network. The first photograph that we looked at, we thought, oh, maybe there was something within the lens, condensation. But then again, we come to see the rest of the photographs which show cloud cover over this object. And then another gentleman sent in this photograph depicting the same identical object. Once again... Getting these photographs from different areas of the world and different people, we're starting to really wonder what that object is. Now, I had a very nice email conversation this morning with one of our loyal Nibiru watchers. Her name is Cheryl. She actually provided us with some of these new photographs depicting this metallic planet. Or can it possibly be some type of planetary mothership. I'm sorry, I'm going to have to go out on a whim there, but it's very odd, and it is showing up in a lot of photographs. So, if any of you have ideas on what this might be, feel free to send me an email. We can discuss it, and if you want, you can leave a comment underneath the video. And listen, folks, I'm just going to let you know 
Do not pay any attention to the negative naysayers leaving all of these nasty comments underneath the videos. That's what they're paid to do. We've gone over that a hundred times. But anyways, we are very interested in hearing comments on what everyone thinks this might be. Now, more photographs coming in from Cheryl. Absolutely fantastic. Thank you, Cheryl, by the way. These two photographs were absolutely amazing. And we were very interested in the one ray of sun coming down to the left of the photograph. Now, it almost kind of looks like there is something behind that ray of sunshine, if you want to call it, almost like something behind it is being cloaked, hidden from our view. And the pink sphere that is in the photograph we really couldn't decide whether or not that was a planetary object reflection, but very interesting photographs. Once again, thank you very much, Cheryl. Now, once again, folks, I just want to remind you that we did change the logo on our Nibiru channel, YouTube channel, and we also changed and will be starting up our Nibiru News YouTube channel, channel. <laughs> So anyways, folks, with all of that said, I'd like to thank all of our Nibiru watchers. You guys do a fantastic job. Would also like to thank you for your loyal subscribership. You can continue to email your photographs and your video to NibiruPlanetX2016 at gmail.com. And don't forget to share our videos with your friends and family members on Facebook. And subscribe to the Nibiru channel for all of our current updates. And like I always say, keep an eye in the sky.